Yeah, no, 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 no. You are in tuned to gender bias where we discuss issues relating to man and woman. Yes, relationship issues, and of course, it's your host, Dirty Bob. But before we get into to this topic, which will be the proposing, it seems to be that women are now proposing to men, or should we just stick with the traditional way of men proposing to women? We'll now take a word from our sponsors Subway, Eat Fresh, QK Pharmacy, Promax Tires, Log Enterprises. Quick Cash, Jams Car Rental, Levi is a trend store. Get your sub of the day. Different sub every day. Monday, Tuna. Tuesday, Veggie Max. Wednesday, Meatball Marinara. Thursday, Black Forest Ham. Friday, Seafood Sensation. Saturday, Subway Club. Sunday, Turkey Breast. Make every day count with Subway. Eat fresh. Welcome to Quick Cash. Whether you need to play or whether you need to pay, Quick Cash is the place to get that loan quick and easy today. Quick Cash, it's cash in a flash. Quick Cash, cash in a flash. Quick Cash is the way, cash in a flash. Call 453-CASH. Avoid the stress of that bounce check. 453-2274. 453-CASH. Call Quick Cash today. Cash in a flash. Money in your hand right away. Cash in a flash. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention please? Promax Tire Sales and Services is your number one spot for new and used tires. Located in Chauncey, they also provide brakes, oils, batteries, rims, filters, parts and accessories. That's right, Promax Tire Sales and Services. Open Monday to Saturday, 8 a.m. until 7 p.m. And Sundays for your added convenience, 9 a.m. until 1 p.m. Give us a call at 453-5355. Promax, tire sales and services. We will meet or be any price. Yes, we're back <laughs> to this topic in case you just joined us. Should women propose to men or should we stick with the traditional route? But before we just dive into that, of course, we have my ever energetic co-host, Miss Sissy, with her flamboyant hairstyle today. Wow. <laughs> On my extreme right, there's a Sim. Name is too long for me. And to the left of the eye, or the opposite of the right, Brother Bath. So yes, Brother Marvin, let's start off with you. Would you be cool with your lady proposing to you? How, how, how would you take to that? I think, I'll think that she will think I'm wasting time. That we're in a relationship for so long. And at the end of the day, we think that relationship is supposed to end, in, not end, but culminate in marriage, right? Because, you know. Most that basic, is the ultimate thing. Right, that is the most basic and important institution of any society. So people get together to create marriage and create this, you know, this, this bond. This bond. Mm -hmm. So if my girl come tomorrow and says, Marvin, what are we doing? Um, I think we should get married. I don't think, well, I waste a lot of time here, then let's go. Um, I think so right I now you're wasting time then, basically. Yeah, yes, <laughs> How would you feel comfortable for your girl come and um, get down on one knee and propose to you? Uh, that would be a little bit embarrassing in public. Women don't really? do that. Hey, 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 hey. Right. If we do that, that means we have sunk to the end of the bottom of the Nonsense, bottom. nonsense. I clearly disagree. Bongs <laughs> Yo, if Why a woman propose, 
Yo, I go feel so good. I go be like, <laughs> I might get butterflies. Like, like why? Normally. Why would? Why would I? I mean, come on. Yo, that mean that this woman is truly and real into me without a shadow of Don't try that. God mean? took so the ribs wait, wait, out wait, of wait, man. Wait, wait, God took the ribs out of man, and it's a man job to provide. Where is that in the Bible? It, it Show it in the Bible where it states that man. Should be the one proposing to, to woman. woman. I, I I never see that though come with that. No woman hello, should ever hello, propose to a man. That mean, that mean you're begging. You're Not, begging for you're begging for marriage. Keep on wait. <laughs> so then so, you come so, so wait, 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 wait. A man is supposed to engage. A man a but man is supposed to take the first step. You understand? But we don't take the first step in coming and get you to be our woman. <laughs> I mean, so why would I bend on my knee and ask so why, to marry So me? why we should bend on my knee and marry Because you is man. Mommy, I'm married. This is how this is going to go, right? Basically, see, what I'm understanding from Sissy is that she is accustomed to the men or the hunters men go after. Thank you very want. much. So she would feel more, you know, like into a guy. Let me be dainty. You know? So I could kind of see that. But then again... I could also see what Muzzy is saying that if you are in a relationship and the girl decides that she wants to take that leave, he feels honored the same way that of you would course. feel honored. But I have to agree with Muzzy that Thank you. I don't see a problem with it. No. I personally wouldn't do it. However, <laughs> I don't no. see a problem with other people doing it. That's just Man, it no. is fine. Ladies, no. it is fine. No. You find a man, you want a man for the rest of your life. Grab them. No. Propose. Go down for any. Don't why? Free. All just Listen. I'll just go down on, on all the knee for other things. So why not you can't go down on the knee to put on the ring. To propose to the man. Women out there. Yes, we we want to be loved too. We want to feel cherished. You have money of like course, Chris, Christiana and I Jim don't ha- Jones. Even That's if I have 50 dollars in my pocket or uh, 50 mil, I still have money. <laughs> but you see, no, that's the next thing. Because if a girl goes and does it, a girl goes and she proposes, Sometimes more more cases than not, the guy isn't even thinking marriage. So then she you might just go and yeah, but, marriage yeah, but it is vice versa. It is the same because it could be that a man might be so all in love, and he decide, boy, you know what? Next thing here, this wonderful woman escapes my grasp. Let me let, okay, let me do okay, let so me do what I feel is right. Why would the wonderful woman right? have to escape your grab because you're not stepping up? So the woman but then if, the if I am going, if I am going to propose, then that means that I am stepping up. <laughs> I, I think that haircut is getting to you. I definitely think. I think the blonde getting to my brain. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I don't. Themselves. Yo, I <laughs> mean, thousand. is it not me and Sam are the only one with it that came with our brains intact today? Don't that, try that. that, that don't that try that. It, 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 nothing is wrong. <laughs> Why with would it? I go down on my knees? And and, and, and and ask you to marry me. That is not right. Yeah, hello, it is. No, we are not living in the 1950s era. It is modernized. So now. hold on. It eh? is just like so, we just like how we so, have emails sending out and our phone sending WhatsApp. We don't have to rely on pigeons and letters and no. things like, like so, so if come I, on, so get if, with the times. So if I go down on my knee and engage you, I, that means I'm the man of the household. No. Yes, I no, am. No, no, no. That the, means I am the breadwinner. Okay. Uh, wait, let us no, let us just go back a bit biblically here. The uh, Bible uh, says uh, that uh, man uh, and woman should it should be of equal equality. Rastafarianism, equality we say. You understand? So therefore, yes, you, you wait, wait, you proposing to me don't mean that you the man of the house and you the, you could propose and I still deciding things in the house. Why? What me? I actually put on a pants. What, I, what, no. What, 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 if what, anyhow what? I engage, I go down on my knee and engage to you. I am the man of the household. So technically you are my well, itch. Th- that is why <laughs> that is why you said you are not going to propose. So therefore, why should I? Bavin, are you uh, still sticking with you would feel you I you wish I wish way. that after this oh. program your girl decides. I know she loves oh, you. Boy, I, that she decides to to propose to you. you and see how you feel. It. Put you on the spot. This is still a personal thing. Everybody's gonna have their own personal yes. quirks about it. That is right. Now in the whole thing with proposals, it does not have to be this big public forum. Exactly. So nobody would know who engaged you. Could you could be having to? dinner and somebody just slip a ring in the in the cake and it oh my god. Well, some you have to right. pay for that some woman to be bigger. I don't know. Let right. let that tradition but say like how it is. Even, but the thing is, even with this proposal tradition that we have, it wasn't so all the time. 
back in the day, you had to go to the woman's father and ask her, yeah. right? Uh, and yeah. let the father and give before, ten cattle and four So you see, you right. see how much yeah. things men had to go through. We are always there out there putting it out. And we have this thing where you have to have a ring. Back in the day, you had to just tie a piece of string around the woman's hand. And it was probably the acknowledged that she's engaged, she belonged to somebody else. There was no big piece of jewelry. So, a lot of the things have changed. But... That's true, because now I've seen people who say they're married and no ring at all. Right. So, anything. I'll give Mose a point here. But my name is Dirty Bob. Good guy. Right? Good guy. <laughs> Dirty Bob. Things have changed, but... You must also remember you're not anything alone. You have a partner, your partner would have his or her own reservations about certain things. If a man don't want you to get on your knees and propose, maybe you should go in a private room and say, Look, hey sweetie, I think we've had X amount of years in this. So my question so let me is do now, this. How, you know? how long you have to be with somebody before they propose? I don't know. I have never been proposed to or <laughs> thought of proposing to someone. Then I'm, still young. I'm still young. <laughs> Very young. Look at me. Look at me. I'm not ready for that yet. <laughs> I think it varies from person to person or from relationship to exactly relationship. Right. Because a lot of people mature differently. So Correct. you might think you're ready for something at a different age opposed to and somebody And I just mature real slow in terms of those things. Just say it. <laughs> I don't know, I just think that to engage somebody that is a big, that's a huge step. On any yes. side, yes. it's a huge step, on any side. Yeah, yeah but uh, you also have to remember, back in the day, this step wasn't even allowed to be given to you. Some places, they tell you, hey, you're 14, you're married, yeah, it's you're yeah, 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 yeah. We are living in modern times, but not that modern that a man should not go down on his knee and engage his woman. Ask his woman, give me a nice little love talk. You know, we have been together for so long and we, just, we went through right. thick and thin and then I realized that you're the person I want to be. Statistics will prove that all men, basically, most men I should say, would feel oh so wonderful that their lady goes down and propose. I mean, it, as Marvin said, not necessarily have to go on your knees. But propose to me, baby. Propose. Let's bring it on. <laughs> I feel it's more ego. It's attached to your ego. So that's where it's going to have a lot of difficulty. So I'm not sure where your statistics coming from. So I don't know. Dirty Bob statistics. <laughs> I don't know how well that might play out. But I feel it might be more attached to the ego thing. Well, well said. Right. So and just, just another food for thought. So what if the, guy actu- the girl actually proposed to the guy now? And he refused. Is the relationship what, really what, over? How it depends on the refuser. Is he don't just blow it out the window? He said, "Babes, well, I don't think that we are at the stage that should be ready. I don't think the relationship should be over because it could be vice versa too. You know, Mm-mm. there's a lot of wait, wait, wait. Easy now. There's a lot of times that men propose to women and the women say no. So I so, mean, it should. It, hey, it is." Two hands clap, not one. Mm-hmm. So therefore, it should be a walk in progress. Possibly, one party is not yet ready to make that step. And as old people say, come see me and live with me is two different things. Yeah, but you if understand? I deal with you 10, 11 years going down the road, and then I feel it's time for us to get married. And Note then- you said, you feel mm-hmm. that we feel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but then if, 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 if for me, if somebody asks me to get married and i am not ready yet guess why and something i don't think that we should be together again because we are not ready because if i don't spend five six seven eight nine years going on with you this is not back in the days when your parents and them used to date together for how long have so much children build house together and they still ain't married and they only get married because of certain reasons they want the name go on so what would your reason be for being married me? Oh. I don't want to get married. Right. <laughs> right, right, right. Hello. That is a weight on my shoulder no, I could but not still. bear. And okay, as, let, you let said, us say, uh, as you said, see me and live with me is two, different, two things. different things. Seeing you is already a hearty. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> live with me is problems. Oh, it must be. But what I'm saying, right? Okay, let's say we we together for five years. Okay. The lady comes, she proposes to me. 
but we are not in the place, let us say financially, on stability. We live in ignorance. But the thing is, and is the relationship over? Back to the question. It should, no, no, no. It should, it yes. Should, it should, for her. For we her see why she has such transmission. <laughs> <laughs> but what, I, what I'm saying is that it should, it must be a work in progress with both entities or both parties. You know what I'm saying, Bavin? Yeah, because I mean, as you said, two hands need to clap. Exactly. So My one hand to clap. And you spend five, ten years in a relationship, you can just throw that all away because the guy says, hey, let me, let me hold off until I got such and such. Or exactly. Yeah, but if we get such and... But, but if we done, you know, we, we build the house, we got... We, we are... Why are you building a house with somebody you're married to? No, oh. back in the days, not now. She not kind of can't That's a financial yeah, disaster you able to put yourself in. You know how much women in this country ain't married to the man. I can't believe it. And either get, get the house and the man vex or the man yeah, get the because, house and she vex. Yeah, because no, the man. reason why she get the me? house because she was smart. So when he sent her so go by the man smart too. when he sent her go by window, she put the receipt in her name. So when they go quotes, <laughs> that's just the receipt. Oh, then, then, but that's just receipt. My fellow brothers out there, buy your own things, do your own shopping. He sent her with the money and she All bought right. it. So when he put the receipt, when whoever cash in the receipt, go in same name. So when he and same mash up now, same get this, same get that. You might leave with just the roof and same walk with the. <laughs> yes, but um, I, let's bring it to a close. I think that definitely, on my part, and I will be sticking, as I said from the, the very first episode, I will be biased towards me and my fellow male, male it is, if that's, that's not even a word, but I will make up words as I go along. You understand? And I know that a lot of us out there would feel so, oh, I, I can't even describe the word. It, it's like, when you see your, 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 your first born for the first time, that kind of overwhelming feeling. You know what I mean? That a lady proposing to you and she would love you. And I know the, the woman does feel the woman does say, oh, they feel oh, the butterfly and all kind of thing when men propose. So That's therefore, it. It, it is very much a sacred moment for both parties. And I definitely bring the curtains down on this particular topic. So ladies, if you're ready for me, come propose now. <laughs> A new name in pharmaceuticals has come to SVG, and that name is QCare. QCare Pharmacy, where the Q stands for quality. QCare Pharmaceuticals is located uptown Kingstown on Halifax Street in the Gecko Building, right opposite the General Post Office. QCare opens Mondays to Fridays, 8 a.m. to 6 p.m., and on Saturdays until 1.30 p.m. We fill your prescriptions promptly. We invite you to come in and experience the new standard in pharmaceuticals. QCare, where the Q Always stands, always stands for quality. For quality. Get your sub of the day. Different sub every day. Monday, tuna. Tuesday, veggie max. Wednesday, meatball marinara. Thursday, black forest ham. Friday, seafood sensation. Saturday, subway club. Sunday, turkey breast. Make every day count with Subway. Eat fresh. Bring white top club. Rum. Till white top done. Oh. Bring more white top crumb out done. What you talking about done? Everybody say bring it. Pause, you ring. Welcome back, guys. And our next topic is how long? How should I structure this sentence here? Would you like a little help? Help me here. Right, right. Okay, so what we are going to discuss now, <laughs> Wilfred, <laughs> your thoughts on ladies who give it up on the first day, the first outing, you know, let out there, give you a present, let you have it. I have no problem with that. You give it up now, you give it up later, you give it up. I think you should wait in 90 days. 90 days. That's three true. months. <laughs> I think you should wait. I'm I have waited a year. I think you I should think. wait. I'm a traditionalist. Okay. So I believe in the waiting game. Thank you. Right? Yeah. But here's your, here's your thing. <laughs> we have a realistic... Well, I might take it waiting as the funnest, coolest thing ever. Somebody has eaten it. Most of the public. F1 racing. <laughs> and he knows I like Formula 1. Right? Everybody knows. People in the community, not. 
they're not doing it right so it's more of a personal thing by the end of the day yeah is you you have to be the one to weigh the benefits versus the disadvantages because a woman might get up give it to a guy first date and she realizes he's a, a, a dog right and her name is being spread out in the public as a Aye. w mm. right? Apple? pretty much those right? wheels in the land yes and to be is, is a rather unfair situation and a funny one yeah but that's unfair it has been going on how long because mm-hmm. if if it was muzzy if it was dirty, dirty, Bob, dirty, dirty, dirty Bob, Bob and me and he gave it up to me on the first day he would come out of this looking like a, <laughs> a macho man no if true. it was me i would have come out look like why that girl ain't Nobody bad who, who i know ah uh, you see uh, it depends on the person too uh, right so ladies you give it up to me on the first day i mean he ain't gonna call you back because technically you were easy all it took was a campfire no, no oh my goodness that's my favorite thing <laughs> Uh, right so i feel as though you should wait reason being especially well i shouldn't say well no let me start over i think you should wait right because most likely people go into situations or go on a go on dates because they want to actually like settle down they want to maybe get in a relationship in some cases really. it doesn't always we, be that we way know each other. it doesn't always be that way but <laughs> usually on a female perspective, most of the time we always look into it from a relationship standpoint. Always. We want to build a relationship. Always. Not really. Not really. I can say, not really. I could agree with her because if you look at the way things go on in the society, as you said, Mose will be the one coming out looking like a champion. But champion to who? I mean, yeah, you gonna have guys that gonna be saying, Yeah, he like it, he, he, he it. deal with it. Come on. But they gonna be women for sure lining up. Was 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 the guy number again? Yeah. All right, so, thank right. you, thank so you. you get the, of you get experience. You see, yourself. that is the other thing too, though. ladies. Yo, all the thing is man alone, sir. Woman, too. Right. Woman of course, we talk. Mm, yes. Of course, boy, that thing is sweet, you know. Boy, Mose, you could imagine. Of boy, course, you know, especially if you're, especially if you pass and we see him, hmm. and then my friends say, hey, your friends say, y'all gonna eat that thing, me, my girl. It was all of that and some. <laughs> But then I won't sell it all because you know I might come back, come back and take back a piece. Of it. Oh my goodness. Tell your friend and my friend and they might want easy. Yeah, but um, I okay. Let's say the lady who gives it up on the first day. I don't think that she should really feel too bad about herself about giving it up. Cause I mean sometimes you know that there are persons who have chemistry and vibe. Just yeah. hit off with instant. Yeah, true. Yeah, and that's true, that's true. Although you may not plan to do it on it the happened. first day. It, 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 it can happen. happen. And sometimes we are, are human. Of course, of course. And we are prone to errors. Mm-hmm. But still, sometimes those first timers end up come off to a lifelong field of pure vibes and excitement and, and oh, long love. Oh, it could be the oh, other way. Yeah. Hatred. Yeah. Well, there's there's a two sides to a coin. There's a pros and cons of every situation and every consequence so you just have to know how to bear with it i mean me giving it up on the first day i don't know what wrong with that everybody, <laughs> so you, I mean, everybody know not around with no that i mean <laughs> <laughs> okay i most times i will not really go out to get it on the first day but if i do i mean there will be cards that i will play to get it on the first yeah, day but yeah but yeah yeah but then if if okay let us let me ask Mark. If you are checking this particular girl, right, and she gives it up on the first day, what are your thoughts? Is it that she's easy? How much other person she did this with? How can I right. see Alarm myself? Alarm bells will already yeah, be going and then, off. And yes. then, and from, and it depends on also the man. If it's a man that exactly the caliber of the man, I don't right. know. It depends on the caliber of the man. If to not me, every man will get that. Right. I don't know. So, if it's a man that's not accustomed to having all the attention on the females, he's automatically going to think, this is a danger point here. Yes. Why me? Yeah, yeah but, why but, also, but me? also, it could be that he, not being in the limelight, might just be able to fit the bill easier than the man who is in well, the light because of the attention. In, that is... in today's society? Yeah, man. With them track feel we're going on here? 
<laughs> well, she has a point there. I, I know men that have trailer trucks of children and everybody knows who they are. Okay. So Every Monday morning, they the clinic. Oh. There you go. Some started football teams. I wish them luck. Netball too. Okay, but let's say you're looking to start an actual like everybody else was talking about like one night stands, right? But let's say you're looking to start a relationship with somebody, Ex excluding the situation with the vibes, with the chemistry, Sam, with that person. If you looking for a relationship, mm -hmm. if I am checking you and I'm looking for a relationship, and you give me nuki the first night. Thank you. You're blocked and delete. I am I, not going to call you back. What? I am going to have nothing to do with you. Oh because God. guess why? Me and you vibes in and all of a sudden. Exactly. Yeah, but why you take? Uh, I am a boy, man. But why boy, you take? Boy, I am boy. a man. No, sometimes no, as a man no, you have no, to no, refuse. You, no. you have to you show that refuse? Exactly. Yes, man. You have to show that Would you you refuse? Yes. So, I have before. Somehow I don't, I don't believe that. <laughs> Me fresh. You see? That's it. You see? See, yeah, that is the thing. You yeah. are stereotyping me. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? No, but know. you have to. Sometimes you have to. Boy, I go like, you know, but I want, you know? Exactly. And then, and then we get high on the road. I say, boy, you're getting nothing. Staff man that them you only have. No, because, yo. <laughs> I know what I am about. You understand? Exactly. So if I refuse, there's a reason behind the refusal. Right, but then there's another way about this. I am going to tell my friend that Dirty Bob is yeah, in Yeah, but nothing. why are you telling your friend this? That's, yeah, because, you because we talk. This is personal. This is personal. Chat, 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 no, chat. because we talk. Ooh, what's the yap for? Okay, so why was the yap for if you get I it keep or my, not? I keep my circle small. When, when, if you have got into a relationship, mm. if the man foot stinking, you're going to complain to you. What do you mean? That is it. Yeah, let me say, let me say my refusal was because of some stinkness or some funk. Oh. So, uh, <laughs> I wasn't thinking uh, of that. I'm just saying, no, but I mean, come on. That's yeah, a whole they, different no, spectrum of life. No, 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 yeah, no, but no, it's no, the refusal. no. It's, the it's still a refusal because there are some girls out there who look like gold. And trust me, them, are them and is mole. I ain't lying for you. No good. <laughs> so, no. I mean, yeah, you had to be careful. Not all that glitters is gold. It's true. Sometimes right. it's mole. Right, sometimes it's mole. <laughs> right, sometimes it's mole. Exactly, and, <laughs> and then there's a there's a thing that is starting up now. It is becoming a danger. It ain't big now, but mm. there are situations where I've known female friends to say, "Well, oh, my sister had called me to meet such and such," and you ask where, and in some random place. It's like, no, True. no, they do no, that no, 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 no. Yeah, no. No. it it is not very common now. But well, from since the airport cut on the other road and down. Yeah, yeah, um, um, I get it done on the side, this so it's free for all <laughs> unless they walk up in a acres mountain. <laughs> oh, jeez, very dark, eh? so just be careful. Oh, you know that. We're well, gonna drive through there a couple of times if I want to reach Bible quick. Bless, all right. <laughs> <Let's recover>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, done. I can't even contain myself, <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so. The, the first day thing is, in my book, not bad. Not bad at all. Get yeah, a week. One week. At least two If weeks. you can't wait the 90 days. <sighs> yeah, if if the days. sexual attraction is that high, if you see them and there's a... Get <sighs> yeah, a week. One. Give yourself some space. Seven yeah. days. Give yourself some space. Yeah, give yourself some space. And then, to be at the end, there's your, your personal business, your personal choice. To me, you're supposed to be yapping. Why men talk so why can't women talk to me? I ain't say men should talk, talk, women talk. Nobody should be yapping. <gasps> and yes, women do talk. You could, man, women could talk like men. So, Bobby, quick, quick, quick point. You would give it up to her on the first day? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sam, would you give it up on the first day? No. Is that, were oh, you just saying that because of TV? Or? No, I'm saying that because that's me. That's okay. my belief. So, if men, you go out on a day? Nope. You don't know? <laughs> I know. You don't know what I All this Greek godness. <laughs> <laughs> I like you Let sometimes. Me tell you. <laughs> my motto is prevention is better than cure. Uh, I would not put myself in a situation where it would lead to that possibility. Hey, so lady, I would hey, I have heard better cut than you grow. Let me, me tell you. I know what I say because that's how I live it, right? Cool. I would look at okay, where are we going? The kind of But then if, if we not look for relationship. You are look for relationship. 
So you are telling me everybody that Listen, is sleeping Listen, I could be a great cricketer. I add up to all different pitches. Trust me. <laughs> He's so much. <laughs> so, oh. yes, on that cricketed note, we, we will conclude that particular segment where we dealt with giving it up on the first date. And I think that we definitely touched all bases. And I think that the viewers would agree and also may disagree. But that is what we are here for. Don't give it away. So now we'll just take a brief word from our sponsors. Jams Car Rental has a fleet of vehicles covering all transportation options you need to discover or rediscover SVG. Whether you want to head to the countryside, enjoy a special weekend, or take a trip to one of our national sites, we have just the right vehicle for you. Jams Car Rental, located in Edinburgh. Call us at 485-6620 or 529-6393. Welcome to Quick Cash. Whether you need to play or whether you need to pay, Quick Cash is the place to get that loan quick and easy today. Quick Cash, it's cash in a flash. Quick Cash, cash in a flash. Quick Cash is the way. Cash in a flash. Call 453 Cash. Avoid the stress of that bounce check. 453 2274. 453 Cash. Call Quick Cash today. Cash in a flash. Money in your hand right away. Cash in a flash. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention please? Promax Tire Sales and Services is your number one spot for new and used tires. Located in Chauncey, they also provide brakes, oils, batteries, rims, filters, parts and accessories. That's right, Promax Tire Sales and Services. Open Monday to Saturday, 8 a.m. until 7 p.m. And Sundays for your added convenience, 9 a.m. until 1 p.m. Give us a call at 453-5355. Promax, tire sales and services. We will meet or beat any price. Street Talk, sponsored by Jams Car Rental. Yeah, so here in the streets for yet another exciting episode of Gender Bass. This is Street Talk, sponsored by Jams Car Rentals. And we have our soldier here right now. He'll be. Dirty man. Well, dirty bab me, dirty man. <laughs> so I be a dirty people. Me not me clean this, me not get back in. <laughs> right? Okay. First question we asking, right? Would you be okay with a woman proposing to you? Or we just stick to the normal routine of a of a man proposing to the woman? Well, right now, with the pan is so no way style. We long time this man used to call for my head. No woman have a call for my head. Came and then get lazy. And now I walk. Come home, meet plate of food. And table, eat and ask how you come after. <laughs> so, so you think said. Right. So you call it a woman proposing to you? Well, think, think, why think me that no man? I be coming to find a woman who love me. Okay, okay. <laughs> well, I hope after this episode that you go find one who love you. Well, yeah, yeah, I'm sorry, you know me a single traveler. Okay, okay. Yeah, sir, long time days, man, you still love a woman. Mm, but no, we hold off for that. Right now, yeah, we are, we are yeah, a woman who love me. Of course, of course. Because when a woman love in a, in a, in a disha program, okay. But when you love them, every fan stop, you're your people, people, people. Yeah. Big Donny sure. peeping, man. Okay, all right. So, the the other thing now <laughs> we deal with is would you give it up on the first date or would you be cool with getting through on the first date? You know, man, we love our connection, you know. Yeah. We join two persons together. Sometimes human, they watch a long time. So if, 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 if the one I met and think, think of work out, you have work out, you might think you get you. But a long time she watched that. Sure, sure, sure. Catch me, I so, so you think set. Okay, so no problem at all. No problem with that, man. Come on, thing, man. thing, thing, thing. We think for happen, thing. Yeah, we think happen in a mysterious way. Okay, okay. All right. <laughs> no, yeah. for now. Yeah, we'll give thanks, brother. <laughs> Please. <laughs> yeah, so we here in this, um, seems to be a video shop. A movie central, sorry. Forgive me, right? Dirty Bob again, straight uh, gender bias. My friend, would you be cool with giving it up on the first date? No, I don't think so. Why? Because it's, it's unusual to do that. It's... It wouldn't, it wouldn't be cool, and personally for me, I won't feel, I will feel kind of guilty about it, because it's not a nice thing. But suppose, let me say the chemistry just hit up. Yeah, there can be chemistry, but not sex. Mm, well, if you do the math chemistry, you could walk out to sex. Yeah? Well, yeah, but a little kissing or something will do, but not, you know, third base. Okay, and the, the other topic, there seems to be a, a, a trend that has started that women proposing to men. It may not have really been that 
great down here. What, what is your take on that? I mean, this is a new era. And I don't think it's really a big deal if a woman wants to propose to a man. I think sometimes women should, you know, should do stuff that will make men happy too. And then make it even better. Right? Uh, most of the times, you shouldn't allow your men to do everything. So even if you propose to them, it could be a friendship propose, a friendship ring. Doesn't mean it have to be a marriage ring. Yeah, but it could go to that, yes. But if for me, I would propose a friendship ring. So you're looking funny, man. Well, so, not I really. Mean, I'm glad for like, hey, a lady who do our man do everything for she. We should do both. We should do for each other. Because as my old my old granny would say, two hand, go a clap. Now one. So if I feel feel that this is the man for me, I will propose to him, yes. What proposal? <laughs> <laughs>
Mom, so you be cool with um, giving it up on the first date? And the first time I let go out, like you, you, you gave him some, um, some squeeze now? No, not the first time. Not the first time I go out, I don't give him no squeeze for the first time. Okay. Why so? No, I don't give him, me and he just go get him, so I go give him for the first time. No, I don't go do that. Okay, and um, would you be cool? Uh, well, I see that you have a ring on your finger. Yeah, that's just, that's just, okay, you're my room, man. Yeah. That, that, that's really nice to know. Um, I just want to know a little bit in your business. Don't mind me too much. No. Did you propose to Mr. or Mr. Proposed? No, Mr. Proposed to me. Okay, so let like me say that he did not. Would you be cool with proposing to him? No, I don't do them things. Why not? No, no, no. I don't ask no man a question. Man, I've asked me a question. But I mean, if two of you in love and in a relationship, it would be cool if you ask him too? No, I don't ask him. I don't ask him. No, no, I don't ask him. No, no, no. I don't ask him no question. All right, thank you so much. Yeah, that's so. Tell us, um, what are your thoughts on a lady who give it up to you on the first date? Well, if I go out with her and she give it up me on the first date, well, it's either like she's easy to get at or she has something that she want to give me or I'm just lucky. Okay, and um, we know that normally, right? Mm -hmm. Men normally propose to women. Would you be cool with a lady proposing to you? Sure. I have no problem with that. Uh, what would be your feeling? I'm going to feel great. If she come and propose to me, I feel really great because most of the time, I mean, like, as you said, we guys are always the one who go about doing the proposing, right? So if a lady come out and she proposes to me and everything is okay, I feel great. Then it should be like, Marshall, happiest man alive. Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> so we're here in this van here, Mr. Thompson van. <laughs> so, mom, tell us, um, would you be okay with a lady who proposes to a man or would you propose to a man? No, I won't. Why not? I don't think it's right. I feel better man proposing to me. It would look like if I force the man to get married to me. So, let me say a man propose to you, won't it? Suppose he feel that he forcing? No, well, it's up to him. It's so, so why can't it be up to the woman also? No, I, I, every woman is not the same, eh? That is true. But so, remember, a, a proper relationship could only work with if, if both parties are... Well, of course, sure. But right now, well, I've been married for 22 years. That's good. Eh? Tomorrow, yeah. make 22 years. Oh, well, happy anniversary to you and your mister. Thank you very much. And I hope that you all live to see me anymore. We we'll so. add another 22 and to get to 50. Wow. Yeah, man. So, okay, um, just a little, a little more stickier topic. Would yeah. you be, what, what are your thoughts on a lady who decides to give it up to a guy on the first date? Well, me personally, I wouldn't want to give it up on the first date. It'd be looking like if I... I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to call you word and, and Desperate. So desperate. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I wouldn't want to give it up on a first date for sure. Maybe fifth, sixth date first before you could. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But giving up on a first date, okay? I am desperate for sex. Sure. Not true? Yeah, definitely. Right. Right. <laughs> so thank you so much and once again happy anniversary. Thank you. All right. Gender where I say me good taxi soldier. Yeah, my brother. Right. So tell us, uh, what are your thoughts on a lady who gives it up on the first date? Well, it depreciates everything that she really stands for, pertaining to moral ethics and value. You know, um, I think a woman supposed to respect herself in more ways than one. But at the same time, sometimes alcohol plays a negative part when they're in a club, etc., etc. But in the end of the day, it's wrong. Because it depreciates the woman herself. Well said. So, would you be cool with a lady proposing to you? I think it's a beautiful thing. We men have been doing it for centuries. And a woman proposing to a man. It's, it's embellishing, it's beautiful, it's a lovely thing. It's a good look. It's a good look, beyond a good look. Yes, I must say. A woman proposing to me today, 2018, it's like platinum, bro. It's like platinum. Definitely. Definitely, right, my brother. Give thanks, man. Lovely program. Yeah, man. All right, thanks. So, are they here with a Dula? Dula, tell us. Oh, what is your thoughts on a lady who gives it up on the first date? And still, you know, you can't get a lady in a bad talk, you know, because a lady will feel comfortable and attention, and you know. so, to me, so that was happiness now, you know, it was not a bad talk, no man can call no man, no kind of name and thing, you know, come on. So, so you can't get happiness if, if she gave money first, day. Come on, man, that's all, all the time. Straight. So, let me say now, if I want to propose to you, yeah. instead of you proposing to you, how do you feel about that? Well, I mean, I'm not feeling no way, you know, like, you know, she has love for me and thing, and she just, you know, feel she want to do it, you know, I'm going to run around out and still check it in. Straight. Give thanks, Zara. Easy.
Jams Car Rental has a fleet of vehicles covering all transportation options you need to discover or rediscover SVG. Whether you want to head to the countryside, enjoy a special weekend, or take a trip to one of our national sites, we have just the right vehicle for you. Jams Car Rental, located in Edinburgh. Call us at 485-6620 or 529-6393. Yes, so we just finished watching Street Talk and Street Talk is sponsored by Jams Car Rental. So panel, what do you think about some of those interviews and questions and um, answers? I told you all the statistics were sure. And I was proven right. I don't really have to say much. My good viewers out there, those who gave the point in Street Talk, they back me up well. Kudos to you. I think you cherry pick the people like No, you know. how yeah. could I cherry pick, cherry pick the directors could could vouch for me that I did not I don't even know half of those people. Uh -huh. The one person who was with Panadula, the last one. Don't you think that he led on the questions? Ah, uh, we could. <laughs> <laughs> I did not. I Gender really bias not. code, yes. No. I agree with the lady, one of the lady in the van where she said, um, she go look desperate. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. For and, lack of a better word. Yes, and she won't give it up on the first date. And why should she engage to a man? Yes. I still agree with her because, as the guy in the taxi said, it depreciates the woman. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Big yeah. yes, yes. so up, bro. Big up, bro. Bro, yeah. Okay, yeah. bro yeah. He, he spoke really well, yeah. And because, all the other soldiers I'm out there who said that they would be the happiest man alive if a lady proposed to them. Come on, man. As a watch, a woman coming out and make me feel love you. All the time we have to love them up, so. Cha. We love you by wash, cooking, and cleaning. Okay, I can't, I can't support you with that one alone. Isn't that a bit sexist? <laughs> That's true, though. Dirty Bob is sexist. Am I? Yes. I like sex. <laughs> yes, um. But I think the, the reviews, the, the, the views are shared by those uh, who participated in Street Talk, they, they answered to the point. Yes. As, I mean, there were a lot of the, the passengers in the van, they, they, they were so welcoming, they, they wanted to speak. Yeah? And, and they did well. You know, the, the van driver said that he, it would be such a great thing if his lady, and, and he go take it, come on, man, right now, take it, Jen. Yeah. Like he and he all this so long. Uh, so the same lady in the van who said the desperation move now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The anniversary don't gone, but we still here at Gender Bias. Yeah, happy name. anniversary. Come happy on, man. Big 22. A long boy. I hope when I do get married, I go, you know. <laughs> at least if I get half of the 22, dog, I go thankful. You know, when if I have to get married, you're in, look at me in the camera, you're not leaving me. We are together forever. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sorry for that guy. <laughs> But I mean, I think that is the, the, the real deal with marriage. Though. I mean, I just always say marriage is a serious thing. It should it be is. between three persons. The husband, wife, and, and the most side. You understand? And if you can't get them thing they don't pack, it didn't make no sense that. So, Bavin, I know you're looking for type of food just now. As you just say in the <laughs> local phone? terms. Yeah. <laughs> type of food. You don't know what type of food you can really move too freely. So, make sure you have them thing there on point, right? And also, there were... Oh! My partner dirty man. So dirty Bob to dirty man, you don't know big up yourself. Yeah, I mean he, he spoke well the very first guy. <laughs> I mean the, the way he spoke really he, gave he us knew a lot. What he wanted. Exactly. He said he was a hard working man of and course. he wouldn't mind a woman to come and um propose. Propose. I mean to him. I mean that, that But then you, you realize something that we don't really want the hard working men that are out there we like the men that dress you know, up like. well people. not to you but <laughs> in consensus with with how relationship wise is going now we don't want the hard working men that go into the mountains and you know and toil and yeah. soil we, we prefer the men that dress neat up and neat polish, and prim yeah. and proper now even that some of the girl now gravitating to them lazy clock man with I the black to say that. yo some lazy you just do or do nothing all they're doing is Wrong thing and you know what I mean nastiness and teeth that yeah. that's all the get studying. With, sometimes people get with people because they want to get in a sort of lifestyle, so maybe they like that. Fame. Fame is a hell of a thing. Excitement kind of Trust thing. Me. Listen, there's no there's no lifestyle in St. Vincent. Really? What is the lifestyle? We have a lifestyle in St. Vincent. Mean? Yes. We do. Eat roast pork hunting. Yeah. And drink plenty. Small. That's mainly. Go church. The um, bouge. The bougie, yes. the wannabes, okay. yeah, and followers. Uh, so, so, Bobby, who, who, who really stood out to you in the in the street? Uh? 
Uh, the three persons stood out. The last gentleman in the taxi, where he said, you know, it depreciates. Oh, yeah, yeah, Mr. Bruv. Bruv. Yeah, yeah bro. <laughs> right? It depreciates the value. And one of the the older women in particular, if you notice, they were the ones that said, and they were all married, that said the man has to be the one. Right, to, cause, and they were it. married long and time. And they are married, which says that they will work for them. So it means that the traditional way can work for you. Of course. Mm-hmm. But yeah, pick the right person. You can't pick gold and expect. Well, you can't pick copper. bronze or copper and expect gold and, gold platinum. and platinum. Yeah, well, you see the other thing too. Who, who, who says that um, no, nothing is, is uh, 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 easy part? True. There's, I mean, to everything, there's some trials and tribulations and a little rocky road. But it's, you know, if you look into go past those burden and obstacles and I, I don't mean, think there's uh, for like two years, two three years. There has been a lot of weddings going on, and a lot of young people are getting suit, married. Follow suit, follow suit. And I am wondering, how are they today? Well, boy, That's a good some of them hand to mouth, yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't. Know. I don't know. We I don't, don't know, like, but you know, so it's it's, no, but I mean, it's yeah. like this big. This crazy. Who ha huh? and yeah. everybody wants to get married. Well, it's a follow and then, suit thing. And then you you realize and then you say, but wait, it's not just the other day, day, day. No, you see that the scene. That's I mean, a, a lot of the things because happening too. You to... realize that uh-huh. you see Speak. some people just get together like maybe one year ago. And they're married. Also, and then you're like, wait. They mean they, they bring the behind like... closed doors all the time. Well, it could be that. A lot <laughs> of people are I wouldn't know. A lot of people, lot of people but um, today in social media, you know, everybody knows who not is necessarily. Not necessarily. Who so knows? Not well, not necessarily, who knows? but then who you know, knows? majority. Majority. Yeah, yeah, but the thing is, right? Some of those marriages are kind of pre-arranged, as you say. Okay, like for example, like for example, I was speaking with a, a friend of mine, and you know, we were just old talk, and then boop, 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 something came up, and it's like. Some parents find out that their daughter having sex or sexual intercourse with a particular guy. They church goes now, in a sense now. Mm-hmm. And you don't know parents always try to hide the, the, the children or Dirty. protect them from, from yeah, shield them from certain <laughs> ills now. Because why they are church goes and those sort of things. So okay, they find out that they're having sex, boom. You, you, you force the marriage and you, you fast forward it so that it could look like thing. And some of them having marriage because you find out that they're pregnant and they're not yeah. to shield it up. But Shots I mean, maths, maths do like, right? So Nine months is nine months. Come on, man, all the time. 40 weeks, something like that. Of course. Right? So, yes. So, people, if you're going into marriage without the three main things, the man, the woman, and the most high, not but the most I should be first. Yeah, well, you know what I'm saying. It, it, it was not in alphabetic form. Right. But, yeah. So, I think that um, today's topic was really well. I mean, it, it went on well, despite mm-hmm. um, Brother Bob's um, <laughs> <laughs> his way of life and his want to do things. I mean, he likes F1 racing, but you don't want to party. I mean, it's cool. I mean, some of us are, are different, you know. Not everybody eats not all the same that, soup. No. Right, so uh, yes, here's where we conclude another exciting edition of Gender Bias. Of course, I am Dirty Bob, Miss Sissy, my co host. We have Sim on the right, and Brother Bob, he joined us today to share his thoughts, and all of us uh, definitely shared our thoughts. And as I said, Gender Bias is all about relationship issues, which affects both men and women. So don't forget to like our social media pages, of course, all the Instagram time. and Facebook. And repeat. yes, remember there's a new episode every Thursday at nine, and a repeat it's on Saturday at nine. And yes, all the social media lovers out there and fanatics, yes. of course, like, like us, hit share. Us up. It's on YouTube, Facebook, know. whatever, whatever, whatever. I'm not sure if it's on Snappies, Snappy Chats, and those sort of things, but <laughs> yeah. Thanks. So we we're out as usual. Our key, we out. Yeah, no, 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 no.
your sub of the day. Different sub every day. Monday, tuna. Tuesday, veggie max. Wednesday, meatball marinara. Thursday, black forest ham. Friday, seafood sensation. Saturday, subway club. Sunday, turkey breast. Make every day count with Subway. Eat fresh. A new name in pharmaceuticals has come to SVG, and that name is QCare. QCare Pharmacy, where the Q stands for quality. QCare Pharmaceuticals is located uptown Kingstown on Halifax Street in the Gecko Building, right opposite the General Post Office. QCare opens Mondays to Fridays, 8 a.m. to 6 p.m., and on Saturdays until 1.30 p.m. We fill your prescriptions promptly. We invite you to come in and experience the new standard in pharmaceuticals. QCare, where the Q you always stands, always for, stands quality. for quality. Bring white up rum, rum. Till white up done. Burn. Bring more white up rum out done. What you talking about done? Everybody say, bring it, bring it. Hey. Bring the up. Hey. Bring the white up rum. Bring it, bring it. Hey. Bring the up. Hey. Bring the white up rum. This rum is one for the party. Hey. This rum is king everybody. Bring it, bring it. Hey. Bring the up. Hey. Bring the white up rum. White oak, when it pours, you ring.